Hello, folks. Again, it's Liz Surrey here, your host of the Tax Advisor and Business Coach Success Podcast. Uh, once again, I'm, I'm doing a series of uh, different solo episodes. And again, it got nothing to do with accounting or taxes. This actually has to do with the business side. And um, I just recently did a, another um um, I call it a motivational, uh, you know, video, and it has to do with certain speakers and business coaches and people that I have really admired for for many years. Uh, not only I have read their books, I have followed their, you know, trainings, and um, and I'm just a follower. I mean, uh, as many of you are, and I think it's nice always to um, endorse and and and, and appreciate uh, some of these well-known speakers, but yet it's nice for them to know that many of us out there are, you know, thankful uh, for their services because I believe that in, as a single speaker can pass on their message uh, to so many hundreds of thousands of people, uh, not only here in our continent, but across the entire globe. And I think that's a powerful thing uh, to be able to do that. Um, well, I believe I do my small share uh, through my YouTube channel and also um, for some of you who probably don't know, but I do have the videos also, uh, you know, uh, for the podcast. Um, it's important that we all stay motivated and listen to these kind of things really help us, uh, you know, just keep moving forward, um, you know, even when things doesn't seem to, um, you know, to be working and understanding that. Uh, I have to, you know, I completely agree more than 100%. Um, and my next endorsement is really with Gary B, or as we call him, uh, Viner Chuck, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Uh, uh, Gary B, you, you've been, you know, a big fan. I'm a big fan of yours, um, out of many others. Uh, but I wanted to especially do this video uh, for you and the entire audience because I think that um, you well deserve it. Um, and you're right, it's all about giving good context and value, and sometimes without expecting anything in return. And I think what matters is that what I am with you on the same page is that legacy is what's important to me. Um, you know, even if uh, in the small scale I can change someone's life. Well, I feel that I did something that was part of my mission, and I, I just feel that I am doing some sort of uh, collaboration or contribution uh, to this uh, planet. Um, so anyhow, uh, let's take a couple of minutes um, and, and spend here this time with me uh, as we listen to Gary B, something that I think was very profound. And this is why I'm sharing this video, which is called One of the Great Secret Weapons to My Success. Um, and that was an interview um, that he just recently had in London. Um, and again, the video title is One of the Great Secret Weapons to My Success, if you want to watch the entire video. But I'm going to go ahead and share just a couple of minutes and part of the reason why I feel I'm so aligned to Gary in that sense of providing content uh, without sometimes expecting anything in return. Um, so let's just listen to this uh, for the next few minutes. Same thing for executive. Listen, I only have 25, 30 points of view. What I'm good at is being relevant on the new and emerging things, whether it's voice or podcast or video. Look, you know, look what's going on here, right? Like, it's the film over the film or the film is to get filmed. Right? Like, it's very, like, for me, these are the things I predicted would happen. They seemed laughable years ago. They are not being laughed at by everybody as much anymore. That's right. So, in the beginning, you know, the people laughed at me, you know, like, you know, doing baby V. Most of them were saying, like, you're like, I'm an asshole, you know. That's right. Looking at the Charlatan, self absorbed. And I'm the same. They told me I'm not this thing because I'm coming to the street with a camera pointing yeah. at me. And they forget that I'm creating content for the community to make their life better. It just, listen, it com comes down to a million different things. I, for me, my intent is legacy. Right? My, I, I agree with I want you. everybody Gary, to remember legacy. that I brought the value. That's right. right? Period. Mm -hmm. I want to be remembered that I brought value. I like it. I like the feeling. It makes me feel good. Sorry. You know, and so to me, that's how I think about it. And um, and so for me, of course I'm doing this because that's what I want. Um, to me, it's a, there's not a lot of things people want in life. You know, there's 
money, there's admiration, there's love, there's, there's these things. And all this stuff is very basic to me, it comes simple. Um, I just don't care if people think I'm the best or the worst. Uh, I'm in my own inside. And so that's why I will always innovate because I don't fear. You don't fear. I don't fear. So if Daily B was a flop, mm -hmm. if my sneakers were a flop, what? Mm -hmm. That's it. <laughs> Entrepreneur. This book is about patience. Yes. Patience. patience. I think patience Extremely is one boring. of the great secret weapons of my success. Mine too. Because you look like you're not patient, but you are, you know, turn the children are very quick, right? That's right. Micro speed, macro patience, clouds and dirt. Okay, so what do you want to inspire in order to polish the work in the readers about your patience? Look, everybody's always trying to prove, the reason I'm patient is I'm not trying to prove anything to anybody else but myself. But I have my whole life to do that. For my whole life yeah. to do that. Absolutely. When you're not patient, you're worried about other people. You want to be successful, so your mom was proven wrong, so your brother was proven wrong, so you proved somebody. You're doing it for somebody. Your lack of patience. You, your lack of patience. You need more. You're not patient because you need more money because you have to buy BMW so that you look successful to your classmates. Mm -hmm. Not smart. Not smart. And not so at all. patience goes hand in hand with being inside your own self. I'm, I'm so thankful that I only guide within my own self. Otherwise, I'd be living my life in a very different way. You know, uh, this big economy, I just first seen, and most of the people in Poland really good at saying, we know this shit. Oh, there's nothing new in the book. But when I look at the Facebook and YouTube, there's, there's nothing there. <laughs> you know what I mean? Of course I know what you mean. There are people who do, and then there are people who judge the people that do. Yeah. Isn't that I a fact? Do, which is which is why I respect what people say. I don't okay. want them to say that. I respect it, but that's a much bigger indicator on them than me. One of the great things I've been able to accomplish in my own mind is this incredible place where I'm at right now where I think I'm just a mirror. I genuinely believe that people, when they consume me, expose who they are based on the reaction of me. Like comments, likes? What? If they think I'm great, they're in a positive, accountable place. Mm -hmm. If they think I'm shit, they're in a negative, I want to blame somebody yeah. else's place. True, and point fingers. Them. Yeah. So, uh, anyhow, folks, thanks uh, if you have been watching this with me or listening to the podcast. Um, again, um, I am highly endorsing um, Gary B. Um, and again, I'm not getting any anything out of this except for um, the world deserve. Um, credit that he, he, he deserves. Um, so for those of you who are with him and as it is with others such as uh, Tony uh, Robbins, which I did another video for him, um, I think it's important that we give credit for all those wonderful um, people out there who have given us so much knowledge and content. And uh, anyhow, thank you, Gary. And um, to all my audience, I appreciate you sharing this with uh, with me. And again, welcome, welcome all your feedbacks. I love to hear what you feel, what keeps you motivated to get into success, uh, not giving up and uh, understanding that it's about sometimes not how much we make is, uh, you know, the kind of memories and the legacy that we can leave behind that people will remember you for, uh, you know, what you created um, on this planet. So. Um, thank you so much, and until the next episode. Uh, again, I hope to hear from you. Comment, 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 like. I love your shares, and uh, I like responding. So take care, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.